Hello my warriors, how is it going and welcome to another episode of Heroes of the Inner Sphere. We are continuing our Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries playthrough and I want to go for another Hero Mech, one of those Heroes of the Inner Sphere missions that I want to start playing today. However, when we take a look at our star map here, we have to go all the way down to Liao space, like right here. It's a pretty long journey and we have a financial report coming up in 41 days. We have 5 million sea builds, which is technically doable, however... Uh, I cannot go the full way in one jump. That means I have to make a break either here in McChenry or like in this cluster or here. And I will probably find something that I want to pick up. So therefore, oh, I cannot even go all the way. Oh, that's crazy. So we have to take a break here and then probably in the other cluster. Therefore, I want to get a little bit more money so I can actually buy myself some nice things there. And that's why we are playing another mission on this planet. And then we're going to jump, okay? So our archer is in very little disrepair. So we're gonna do that, and the other guys we will just repair on the industrial hubs, especially the Marauder, it will take a lot of time and money. Maybe we can actually afford the Black Knight here, actually. <laughs> that was a bit too quick. Let me see. Um, if I repair that, that is a lot of days. 34. Do I want to invest 34 days here? I don't think so, no. I think we can actually play the Warzone mission just as it is. And it's for Steiner dudes, we are playing 85 rating. Oh, uh, by the way, um, I'm saying skull rating every now and then. There is nothing about skulls here. This is kind of a thing that comes from Rogue Tech, from Battletech, the PC game, that I'm always confusing because, you know, I'm kind of so used to say skull rating because that's how the difficulty is measured there. This is just a numerical value here. Uh, anyway, uh, do we take salvage? No, we are taking flat money. I think that's what we're going to be doing. Uh, we're going to take the three salvage shares with us, three and a half million, maybe an airstrike. You know what? I think we're gonna go in with the Bravo Bad team news, in a pretty big environment. And I think I want to take the Kentaro here. That's the Tribuchet. There's the Kentaro. Let's drop some SRMs, sh some short-range missiles on our enemies. This guy is pretty good with ballistics. He's gonna take the Hunchback. And then we have ooh, Captain Rogers. Rogers is okay with energy weapons, but not really with ballistics. I wanted to give the... where is it? The Jager mech or the Dragon? Um, I mean, you're gonna take that then and just play fire support, okay? I hope your AC5s are doing things. Maybe I should take the AC20 of the dragon, though. I don't know. I don't want to get the dragon destroyed, therefore... Ugh, the dragon is the better mech. Yeah, we need everything that we can get here. Do we have somebody else with uh, good ballistic weapons specialty? No, not really. We should maybe train some spare pilots. That would be a good idea. Also, Lieutenant Bats. Why are you in Bay 3? Oh yeah, because you are such a great ballistic specialist. I mean, you're only, you're capped out at 33, so I should probably look out for better pilots, like 50, maybe even 60? We'll see. So we have 235 tons down, <laughs> god, <laughs> out of 400. <laughs> we have 8 days for repairs for the Archer, but I think I need that thing on the battlefield. We have me as a brawler, we have the dragon as a brawler, we have the, uh, the Archer as fire support. And, uh... Who was the fourth again? I forgot. We have another mech there. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Let's go. I really hope that we can get this done quickly. Um, if they are slow-paced assault mechs, I will drop artillery on their heads. I think we can probably deal with the fast movers ourselves. And the important thing is that we are not losing too much armor early on, so let our friends help us out. Oh, of course, the last guy was the hunchback. Okay, two enemies here, fighting our friends already. We have a commando and the Vulcan, that's good to know. Um, and what else is here? Nothing so far. Yeah, it's only two. Got it. I do believe that I also need to preserve my ammunition in this, maybe. I mean, we have a thousand missiles, that should be okay. Oh yeah, that medium max cannot run through barricades. Um, okay. I need to help out the friendlies. I need to keep them on the battlefield for as long as possible. Therefore, we're gonna invest some of the missiles to get through here. Super important. Urban mech. Ooh, that Shadowhawk is getting torn apart. Yeah. Let me try to be quick here. Good news is we are running 81 kph. We have a quite bursty build. Which means that we can overpower our enemies uh, from behind. That's what we do today. Commander lost a leg already. The Vulcan is in pretty good shape still. Alright, let's go then. I'm gonna go for the Vulcan. 
All, all the trees ate my missiles. It's the title of a nice hero, uh, horror movie. <laughs> the trees ate my missiles. Okay. Turn around. Is it gonna come down again? Yes. Still not dead. Whoa. Alright, we got that guy. Now cool down. Go for commando. Stay in motion, that's important. Strong leg? No, actually it's the right leg. Okay. I mean the left leg is the right leg. What? <laughs> cool. So that was the first wave of attack. The good thing is we have we have to destroy 14 enemies. Not all of them will be maxed, by the way. Uh yeah, strike right away? I could do that. I think there will be bigger forces coming later. All right, we're gonna take it slow. Also, don't waste all of your ammo. Ah! Okay, Orion. Orion. Attack order against the Orion directly sent. The other guys in the outskirts are just tanks. All right, cool. So we try to go to the back of the Orion. Maybe we can backstab him. Maybe we should backstab the Centurion. Oh, 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 oh. Yup. That's one hit. Let's stay in motion. Come on, come on, come on. Twist again. Let's twist again. Like we did last. Summer. Ah, headshot. Can we do that? Actually, also, let's stay in his bag. Ow. And if you shoot the butt, then we have the, the bag hitbox. That's pretty good. That was very efficient. I love this mech so much. Get a golden boy, which is the hero variant of this Kintaro, which has way more missile hard points. Oh, let's say it has more weight to work with. So you can actually put more missiles in it. Maybe we don't even need all the missiles here. We can drop ammunition if we are like so efficient and get more heat management in the mech. And I mean, double heat sinks would be the optimal way to do it, I guess. All right, so four out of eight down. This is an Igor. All right, so we have a high priority target. I want my friends to engage that guy, like right now. Oh no, wait. Oh no, 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 no. Should I? No, I will not. I will not use it yet. All right, so there is a lot of stuff. That guy is down. That's perfect. Um, friends, can you help me? There is a very, very nasty rifleman. Ooh, you hit him a bunch of times already. No, where to? Back or forth? Make your decision, dragon. Ah! The dragon is dancing in front of my face. Not friendly. Okay. Again, back shot against the scent. We'll try to hit his butt. And he's back again. And down. No, not down. Not down. Now he is. Alrighty, so far so good. I think we can actually get it done quite nicely here. I need to take that side torso down before we do anything else, I think. That PPC needs to go. Alright, so this guy has an LRM and two lasers. That's it. There are more hostiles? Okay, now the airstrike. Okay, okay, okay. And... Here we go. I really hope it works. I really do hope. Oh, <laughs> Cyclops. All right, they're getting hit. Yeah, that's good. I need to deal with that guy quickly, and then we can turn around again. Okay, so far so good. Oh, the rifleman. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That worked. So, guys, uh, go for the clops. That thing has an AC-20. Actually, we're going to stay in cover for the time being. I don't want to go all out there yet. Oh, that Warhammer is also a problem. Oh god. Alright, let's go in. Here we go! Backstabbing like a boss. Uh oh. Butt shot? No, that wasn't enough. Alright, one more alpha strike, come on. Alright, we got that guy. <laughs> now it's time for the rifle, man. Oh, I don't like fighting in open terrain here. This is not great. But I think I have to do it. Oh, I'm gonna go for that guy. Right. Oh. Two alpha strikes is enough. And you are not moving anymore, buddy. You have no legs. Come on. That was good. That was really good so far. All right, guys, follow me. Oh boy, you, Mr. Dragon. Uh, wait, Dragon, 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 Dragon is the fourth. You go there. Okay, Mr. Rogers, don't destroy my mech. That would be very much appreciated. Um, there's one tank and then three mechs coming from that area, right? Is Rogers going up there? Yeah, so he is now... <laughs> he's now on penalty in the silent corner. Uh, I want you to come. I want... Oh, no, 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 no. Press the wrong button. Um, yeah. God, managing your team is not easy. 
That's a Zeus. And the catapult. And the quick draw. Oh god. That's so much, guys. This is so much. This is so much. Uh, the German is coming out. Oh no. What are we doing now? I think we are <laughs> going for the quick draw. <laughs> ah, good. Okay. Butt shot. Nope. Ah, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keep him twisted. Keep him twisted. Got one. All right. Next up. It's the Zeus. Actually, oh, this catapult is gonna deal so much damage. Ah, we're gonna grind through his front here, I think. Do we have the heat for it? I don't know. We will see about it. Alrighty, friends. Help me out. Good shot so far. Oh, God. Alright. That guy is down. Um, I think we can afford the all-out attack now. Hmm. You're gonna watch this. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Help, please. Please help. I mean, we have our archer that should be able to fire at him. I mean, he's going for our archer now. That's beautiful. Um, I want you to attack that, Mr. Archer. Maybe that's not the best idea in the world, but hey, let's see. So, Captain Rogers is about to is about to die. After the catapult and the tank, we gotta go. Hey, cat. Yeah, you are not able to shoot me anymore. Yeah, isn't that funny? You have no range. You have... Uh, I'm in your minimum range. Can I headshot you? I, I can try. I can certainly try. Try again. Try again. Nah. Oh, whatever. Shoot him. All right, guys. Evac. Oh, God. 2,000 meters. Yo, guys. Uh, you will follow me. I'm not gonna fight anything anymore here. Good news is that, is that the archer is fine, the hunchback is fine. My Kintaro took a bit of a beating, but that's to be accepted from a brawler. But I think everything considered, we are coming out of this pretty much alive. Hopefully. Depending on what they bring. And, and if they are attacking us directly. Oh god, I just wanna see. I see a Cyclops and a Battlemaster. I see a Cyclops and a Battlemaster. Alright, we, we are out of here. Ooh, Igor! Oh my god, Igors. These guys have to go, quickly. Alright, one down. Two down. We're gonna keep moving. You can have some fun with the flyers there. Buddies, no problem. But I want you to follow. I want everybody to follow. We are not engaging that. Just, you know what? Everybody, move here. Yeah, that's right. That's where you go. The fastest way possible. <laughs> Man, I want to keep my assets intact, but I think I can actually handle it. Oh, can I? I mean, the back shots are real here. I still be... St I think we are still running, right? Do I send my archer around? Mm, just hold it, buddy! Hold it! Don't die! Oh, God! This is what you want to get from a uh, hashtag quick mission before you go. Oh, the intense round. But I would say everything considered, we nailed it here. Absolutely. Question is, do we nail the coffin of one of our pilots? No, we're good. We're good. Alright, we have some repairs to do and we're gonna come out of this with 3 million sea builds. We did it. And I think the artillery strike was actually quite good. That enabled us to deal a lot of damage to the um, the rifleman early, so we could lag him even at medium range, and I didn't have to run in his back there. But as you could see, the backstabbing Kintaro is really good. That thing is amazing. Has enough mobility to get where it wants to be, and then two alpha strikes, and the enemies are down. Now we could have taken the Cyclops, but we couldn't at the same time because we didn't get enough salvage rights here. There's a lot of good stuff on the battlefield, but you know what? I'm okay with picking an LRM-10 tier 4 or medium laser tier 4. We're still using a lot of mediums. Maybe that's the way to go about it. Yeah, yeah I'll do it, I guess. Let's take that. Good old medium. Why not? So, uh, oh, and a, an SRM-4. Why not? In case something falls apart. Was that challenge accepted? Oh, that's an achievement. Hey, we did it. Alrighty, guys. Now let's take a look at the star map because we need to lick our wounds. We're gonna go to... Caledonia? Kasparin? 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 I have no idea. Um, Alright, let's go down there. Let's see. 
We're gonna start repairing there, then we're gonna continue our way down to the south of the Inner Sphere, and we wanna play the Heroes of the Inner Sphere special mission. I think it was the Will of Kali, that's what it's called. So, let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> also, ah, whatever. Alright, we have a cantina here. Let's see. Kill, <laughs> kill three stalkers. I don't know about that. It gives us good money, though. And a PPC tier 5 and a double heatsink. We are not really seeing stalkers yet. It's a very good mission, but should I just take it for later? I don't know. I don't know. Finally, there is a heavy rifle and a good one available. I know, guys, you wanted me to play a heavy rifle, and I kind of announced it, but then I lost track. Um... Yeah, that's the thing. Um, collect Assassin Max, collect Enforcer Max, kill Enforcer Max, kill Cicada. We have not really seen Cicadas lately, and Assassins are also probably things that we don't see anymore. And we're not going to Davian Space, where Enforcers are common, so I don't think we're gonna take that. Instead... We're gonna take the Stalker Destruction? I mean, it's double heatsink and a very good PPC. We'll take that. And definitely the tracked units. Do I want to go to the farm territories here? I don't think so. We're gonna keep the last spot open. Um, anyway, take a look at the market. We can buy two autocannon twos, which is also a cantina mission that we have. Let's buy them. Why not? Uh, large laser short burst tier three. That's a good one. That's a really good one. There is a very good PPC for a 1.5 million C builds, an SRM4 stream. I don't like the stream so much, I like the packs more, I think. Because you can instantly shoot all the damage out to one, kind of one spot. It spreads still, but still, it's, uh, it's good. I don't think I want to pick up anything else here. Let's take a more important look over here to the mech market. So we have a Victor 9S and we have a Banshee. The Victor is interesting because it's speedy. It's uh, running 64 kph in an assault mag, but I consider Victor's just a heavier heavy with uh, 80 tons instead of the 75, which kind of ends the 70 uh, the, the heavy tonnage bracket. It has an AC20. It has one missile hard point. It's medium, which is okay, and two energy. The Dragon is better, I think. The Dragon just does the job, just fine. Is faster. Has mask on top of that. And sure, the Victor has more armor, but. I don't want to invest into a Victor right now. We have to pay 7 or 8 million C builds and then repair it again. No, and the Banshee 3C is just bad. Sorry, 3E is just bad. It's... no. Low mounts, one big energy, one medium ballistic, one small. It's not good. So, no max for me. However, we have barracks. And I want to see if I can find better pilots that I can start training. Doesn't seem like it, so... What we're gonna be doing now is we're gonna quickly repair everything. Did anything go critical here? No, you're yeah, still fine. Alrighty. Well done, man. Well, well done. You used your armor to maximum effort. Okay. So we are ready to keep going. We have 7.3 million seabills, which is amazing. So if there was, and there is, a hero make available, I will check it out. And then we're gonna go down, alright? I wanna take a look at another set of pilots, and I wanna see if I can pick some more things up here uh, in terms of um, weapon systems that we want for our Cantina mission, and maybe there's that one weapon system that I want, so let's check it out. The good question is, what do I want? Right now, I wouldn't even know. <laughs> alright, okay, so this is lucky number seven. This is interesting, actually. Oh god. Um, that thing actually has a build. It has two large energy, three medium energy, jump jets, and one small energy. And it's another 80 tonner. Again, a heavier heavy. And that's super interesting. But let's take a look at what else, uh, what else we got here. There is a Cyclops 10Z. It is okay. It's an okay mech to have, really. Uh, it's uh, fast for an assault mech, so 64 kph, it's 90 tons, and it runs an AC-20 and two SRM-4s. I know it's running an LRM-10, but it runs two SRM-4s, trust me guys. It's a crazy brawler if you want to. It's pretty good. There's a King Crab as well. I mean, that's a freaking King Crab. That's a King Crab. And then there's a Zeus, which um, you know, has some options. I can see a Zeus as a support mech that has just a bit more armor and, you know, helps me out with uh, a little bit of support fire coming from an LRM-20. 
and three medium lasers and an AC-5 or a heavy rifle or something. Is this our heavy rifle build? I don't know. I am looking at this charger here though. And I want to quickly press Q for overview. And ooh, this guy has 15 single heat sinks in there, so it's actually decently cold. Let me see. Where's the cooling rate? 2.5. That is amazing. This mech is good. Ish. It's actually pretty okay. I mean, the amount of energy hard points is, is good enough to make something out of this. I would probably drop the jump jets, get even more cooling on the mech. But is it better than the Black Knight? It just serves the same role as our Black Knight with less energy hard points. We're missing a large energy hard point here. So if you get that thing and you don't have a Black Knight yet, I would say pick it up. It's okay. It's really good. The answer or the question is, do we just want more armor on the battlefield? I can see that working. Absolutely. Oh, this is difficult. This is really difficult, guys. <sighs> We should also take a look at the Dervish, which can also be an SRM boat or anything. I honestly like the Zeus more because it's a bit more versatile right now. Or I just pick up the King Crab. Having a King Crab on the board? I wouldn't run it, probably. Not yet. Not in the missions that we are playing. I mean, this guy... Hear me out, guys. This guy here runs 64 kph. And it has 15 single heat sinks in there. Let me see, armor-wise. Total armor, 320 out of 320. That thing is maxed out on armor as well. So it has a lot of weight capacity. I can perfectly see this guy running two PPCs, a bunch of medium laser, and have it somewhere in the back, uh, helping me out with support fire. I think this is an AI mech. And for that reason, I'm gonna buy it. Yeah, we need more armor on the battlefield, and that lucky number seven. It's just cool, man. It's a hero mech. We should pick it up. Let's go. So for that reason, I'm gonna go to the market. I'm gonna buy an AC2 burst fire, and then I will sell... Another bunch of items here. Because I need more money. Uh, those AC-10s can go. Pretty good. Yeah, large laser is the thing that I'm gonna keep. We have some flamers. Do I want the flamers? They're not really giving us that much money anyway. So, we have that one heavy rifle. Some LRM-10s. Yo, those were our money picks all the time in the missions. And I wonder if I can even get there. I'm gonna... <clears throat> Get rid of the machine guns? Sure. These are pretty good machine guns, but who cares about machine guns at that point? Okay, PPCs can go. We have 7 PPC T1. Sell some of those. We need to get to 10 million C build. I will never run small chemical lasers, I think. Nor will I run regular small lasers. Alright, here we go. SRM2s are also not a thing that I even enjoy. There's a pretty good SRM6 here. Artemis? This is just money for me. Come on, guys. We're gonna crack the piggy bank. Lots of singles. Chem laser ammo. Small. Let's get rid of that as well. And here we go. We have enough money. The problem is that I don't want to sell... Actually, I can get rid of those SRMs. I don't want to sell any more items. And the only thing that we can sell now is an, uh, a mech that we have here. Another Kentaro for 1.2. It's the one that is damaged. Yeah, it's the one that's damaged. All right, so we're going to sell that. Okay, and now we can pick up the charger. Now we have one million extra, so we have to travel a lot. Therefore, we need to think about that. Here's the charger. Also, oh god, I haven't even taken a look at the barracks, and I will probably regret that. 47 is way better than what we have right now. Okay, who do we get rid of? This is four out of eight ballistics, which is good. I'm thinking about you. 24 out of 33. Will I? I mean, those pilots can train a bit better, a bit more. Lieutenant Betts, you have served me well, but I think I'm gonna replace you. The biggest one is 47. Again, good ballistics, good everything. And, and lasers. I'm gonna to take you. Alright. So, and that means we need to get rid of Lieutenant Betts. Actually, we're gonna keep Betts. I'm gonna drop Sinclair. Alright. Having a spare pilot is maybe not the worst idea in the world. Anyway. Uh, here we are, and... We, we picked up the mech already, correct? Yeah, there it is. All right, let's uh, make a build out of that. Because, as I was saying, those short burst lasers are fine, but <laughs> I think we're gonna make it PPCs. Because the heat management is already pretty good. 
and the long range damage from uh, from that is it's just amazing. Small laser definitely gonna get dropped. By the way, this thing is not maxed out on armor. It's far from being being maxed out, which is kind of weird. I gotta say, interesting. I need more armor, armor. I, I want that maxed out. Ooh, maybe it's not as good as I thought it would be. Let's go to 60 on the legs. I think we don't need more than that. But I need that front armor. That can be like 15? 14? Let's let's keep it 15. Okay. Again, this is an AI mech for me. And now we are two and a half tons over. Don't like it. Alright, so this is how we play it. We have to get rid of three tons. It's not better than the Black Knight. I shouldn't have picked it up. I regret my decision. I have Bias Remorse already. But okay. I mean, we have two PPCs and three medium lasers on that guy now. Which is... Solid. Yeah, it's solid. It's okay. Would I go back to lasers? To, to large lasers? Would I take chem lasers here? Would I go back to the short burst? Maybe I'll do it. That frees up a bit of uh, tonnage, which means we can actually bring some heat sinks back. Maybe that's the way to go about it. Problem is, that's kind of a limited range now. And I want something that can engage at longer ranges to help us out dealing early damage. So, I'll take the peeps. It's not a real good consolidated build, but I think it's okay for an AI pilot. Alrighty guys, we have... Number seven on the board, and I want to keep the paint job. It's pretty cool. So, um, we have uh, 54 days. We need to sell more. Uh, I need two financial reports up front, um, and therefore we're going to get rid of some some ammo or whatever, but we can drop here. The jump jets. All the jumpies. All of them. All right. Bam, bam. All right, so we have 1.3, which is, uh, yeah, more than double. All right. Let's go and play some missions, because we are desperately in need of playing some more missions. Gotta go down there, but we cannot go there in one go. Alright, we're gonna go to the next cluster and see if there's something we wanna pick up there. Or we're gonna take a look at the things that we won't take because we have no money anymore. <laughs> oh man, maybe I should have not taken the charger. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Again, it's an okay mech to have. It's fast though. So there's that. Ah, an awesome! It's not a good one, but okay. And an Atlas. And I wouldn't have picked the Atlas here. The RS is the worst one, I would say. The absolute worst. It's a long or mid-range build, and I think the other ones are just better. Stalker 3H, though. Oh my freaking god, that would have been a support mech. Oh my god. You see what it does? You don't even have to change the build so much. It's just that. And it's cheaper. I would have loved to play that. Uh, but anyway, that's okay. We'll not take it. We will, however, take a look at the barracks because we might want to find some. Or we will find somebody here. No. Mark it. Give me some more auto cannons. Oh, Fruitable! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh, you don't see it. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna scroll. <laughs> a ghost tier 5? Oh, you know I gotta pick it up. Oh my god. You know I gotta pick it up, guys. That's a tier 5 Gauss rifle. I'm gonna sell a battle mech for it. Uh, trebuchet. Trebuchet? Trebuchet. Pfft, whatever. <laughs> Get rid of that. Uh, <laughs> sell mech, please. Thank you. Alright, almost got it. Holy macaroni! That is a lot! And we're also gonna sell... Oh god, what do we sell? Uh, SRM ammo? I mean... We can probably... Probably get rid of a lot of it. Maybe some machine gun ammo, which is not really worth anything. We have some LRM ammo that we can sell. We probably don't need more than like... Four, three tons? Alright. Any weapon systems that we want to get rid of? There's an AC2 burst fire... This Okay, I guess. Let me see. F flamers. Why do we have flamers still? I want to keep those, though. Large chemical lasers is fine. Large laser is fine. Shot burst? I mean... 
now that we have the short burst, we can probably get rid of the large. There is another tier zero, basically. LRM fives. Good. Get rid of those. We are still not there yet. God, man. Medium chemical laser. It's a replacement for the Black Knight. Short burst laser is uh, fine, I guess. Gonna keep those peeps. We're really low on, on assets. Alright, I'll drop the stream. I'll drop this. We need to afford the Gauss Rifle and ammo for it. Alright, we can afford the Gauss Rifle now. Bing! And now we need ammo. Gauss ammo. All the ammo that is available. Alright, here we stop. What do we need? Uh, 40,000? 80,000 seabills is what we need. I have... I would have never thought that we would get into money problems here. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get rid of the AC2s. Sell. I don't think that we will run them anytime soon, so let's get rid of them. And then we're gonna buy Gauss ammo and all the half ammo as well. <laughs> Gauss rifle, tier 5. <laughs> Holy crap, I don't know where to or how to run it yet. I mean, I could technically run it on the dragon, but that's such a big weapon, and the dragon is so good at brawling, so... I don't know, I, I have the Marauder that can take that thing. Technically, but it's a bit too heavy, I think, for the Marauder. We will see about that. But we have a freaking Gauss Rifle now. Oh, and we have a financial report coming up again. Firestarter? Do we drop it? We rarely use it. It's good for demolition missions. I want to keep all the other mechs. It's important to me. But we need 500,000 C builds. I can drop a Thunderbolt, I think. Don't need two of them. And I will drop... The 5S? Probably? I don't know, actually. Um, maybe it's the Firestarter. Yet again, it's really good at wrecking things. The Jäger Mac. I'll drop the Jäger Mac. Alright, let's do it like that. I'm gonna sell it. Okay. We have room now. And we picked up a new Mac. Which is hopefully a good replacement for what we just dropped. And we got a Gauss Rifle. Okay, before I do anything else, do we uh, take a look at this? No, we don't. It's fine. Uh, let's, let's keep going. Let's keep going, guys. There's a Hero Mech available up here, but who cares? Can we go down here now? We are still not quite there. Alrighty, so we go to New Western. We have enough money to sustain ourselves for a while. And uh, I think... I think we're gonna just go and play missions now. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, two PPCs on the board on the charger. I think this is good. This is gonna be very, very helpful. Cantina available. Collect a crab. For a light rifle. Alright. Kill three blackjacks. For an LRM5, tier 5. It's not really that interesting. Uh, kill three hunchbacks. I wanna collect a crab, maybe? Alright. Let's go. Gonna take this whatever mission. It's one of those random missions that you can find in the sector. And there is none available on this planet that we are. No, wait, there. are. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Um, should we just play the defense? Oh god, these are so easy. What's going on here? Should we just play the story mission? We might want to do that. Just, you know, get, get some money back? Just money. Actually, those could actually net us in a crap. One second. Before we make those decisions, we're gonna take a look at the star map here, and we're gonna press Q to see what intel we can get here. We see um, griffins that are very common here. We have uh, quick draws in the rare bracket, uncommon Kentaro. Crabs are very rare? Uh-huh. Uncommon, uncommon. But they are... possible. We'll see a lot of centurions here. Um, anyway, I want to play a mission, and I think, yeah, a little bit of a change of plan here. I'll pick, I'll pick money. It's 26 salvage, we can get a mech here. I'll do it. Okay, we're gonna play this defense, and, um, you will take, you will take what? You'll take the Thunderbolt? Still, oh wait, too, too, too high. 
Uh, you will take the fire starter. All right. Exactly what we need. And just to mix it up a little bit, I'm gonna pick the dragon. And we wanted to replace one of the pilots, right? Yeah, it's you. It's you. Uh, you will play this guy here. Because we need we need to train and everything. It's an investment. So again, little, little uh, change of plan here. I'm gonna play this mission here, and we're gonna start the the Will of Kali or whatever that's uh, Hero of the Inner Sphere mission is uh, is called in the next episode. I got sidetracked with all the markets here, but I think it's good. I think it was 100% worth it. We have a freaking Gauss rifle, tier five. So it's a defense mission. Should be doable. And not a moment too soon. And also I wanted to check out my dragon in the state that it is in right now, because I didn't do it yet. Alright, let's go. Fan out and take defensive positions. I'll take it. Okay, why not? There's nobody coming. No, the attack is a lie. Oh yeah, we also can play those cantina missions. That's pretty good. I'll sell my people. Uh, sell, send my people over there while I'll go all out here. And shoot! <laughs> that shot, the bullet drop, Ooh, curving over the hill. Oh my god, that was so good. Tank destroyed. Who needs more than one shot? <laughs> I'm so happy about that. Oh man. All right, let's help out here on the other side. Let's get done with it quickly. Uh-huh. And that's a Manticore down. Wait, is there more? First attack was three. And by the way, I, I know that a bunch of you guys get motion sickness from, from this dragon just wobbling all the time. And I do too. Uh, I try to keep the, the bursts at the minimum, but I just need to check out if there's something else on the horizon here. Alrighty. Okay, Rihanna, give me the good stuff. Give me more at the same time. I mean, this is a tier 30 mission. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's go. So how fast are you? How much do I need to actually leave my shot? Nah, definitely not. Ah, whatever. Let's take the lasers. Those things are so fast! Stay here! Ah, Alright. I gotta go. What are you shooting? Oh, there's a mech! Look at that! Sukaido! Kaboom! AC-20! Ah, we like them. He's not gonna go anywhere anymore. But there's another one right here. By the way, did we get all the VTOLs? No. I need to really learn the velocity again. That's it. Yes, you are not moving anymore. And then, point blank, I cannot even hit. <laughs> boom! Alright, down he goes. You just have to say boom every now and then in order to actually lead the bullet to the right spot. There was also a VTOL here. Well, let's get that thing real quick so we can finish the mission. Bullet drop is so massive. It's crazy. But I do like that we can actually uh, finish those Cantina missions on this planet here. It seems like um, we have to kill warriors and tracked units so far. So that's cool. And then we can pick up some, some other ones that, you know, uh, give us a bit, bit better rewards. Just finishing what we started here. Like that. Nope. Yeah, technically. Technically. Right, let's go for the harasser. Help out our little Jenna friend. And then we go over here because I saw something. This mech is so good at intercepting. I love it. Oh, okay. Also, I think the mask sound could be a little bit more um, obvious. There was that very little... Wake, wake! 
and I think it it could be a bit more. Also, the, the flashing on the side when the mask is getting into the red zone or into the orange zone could be a bit more. As same with the heat gauge. But I heard that there are mods for it, so I don't know if the modders are already on the on the heat scan mod. I think there was one. Um, but, um, I don't know. Um, in, in terms of modding, by the way, um, we will... Here's my plan. We will catch all of the assault... Uh, all of the Heroes of the Inner Sphere Max on the Heroes of the Inner Sphere missions. And, uh, then we're gonna start modding the game, okay? So we're gonna play it basically vanilla. Until we have... Ooh, that's a rifle, man. Um, until we have all the Max, all of the Hero Max, all of the special missions. And then we go modding. Stay in motion. Very nice. Okay. So, 26 out of... Oh, sorry, 16 out of 26. Does it mess with my aim, by the way? No. I have the feeling that masking uh, doesn't mess with your aim in this game. It doesn't shake the cockpit or so. It just makes you faster. Oh, what? Oh, that was weird. That's a rock. We need to hit that AC-20. <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm gonna zoom in now. And I'm gonna hit. No! No! My AC-20 fails me! What is going on here? It fails me big time. Alright, let's pursue him. That assassin is not allowed to stay here. Also, he is on. Finally a hit. Alright. This thing is fast. I mean, obviously. It's an assassin. Stay here, buddy! Maybe we just lag him? Nope. I mean, it was a hit, technically. <laughs> this guy is giving me a hard time. No! There we go. The real estate! Who needs that, anyway? So, we are almost done. We have a cicada to destroy. We have a tank to destroy, I believe. And we dealt a little bit of damage to our leg there, which is unfortunate. Treading the needle, but not hitting. I should stay with my SRMs. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. So, we have 76% health. I'm gonna take a little bit more. Sorry! <laughs> There we go. So, I just wanted to get over with this quickly. This is just a money grab for me. The last six enemies. I really hope that they are coming in soon. Alrighty. So, 20, 26. Panther. Should probably attack the panther right away. Uh, the problem is the projectile is so slow. That guy can easily just avoid it. Always so close. Uh, anyway, we'll take those. Ha! Huh. Yeah, we hit something. Oh, it's not dead. What? Now it is. All right. What are you doing here? Go away. All right, hit you. Splat uh, splashing now, spreading the damage is, by the way, not really advised. You should always go and target one target first. And then bring it down, so it won't shoot you back anymore. Alright, here we go. Now the Cicada. I think I will give this mech to an AI pilot. I'm not really good with the AC-20s right now. <laughs> right, mech is going critical. Last two enemies are VTOLs. Let's take them out, guys. Let's just go for it. Maybe I should use Armlock more. Hey, got him. And the last one. Nope. It's so crazy. I hit that first shot and I nailed it. And then... Mm, not happy with my AC-20 shots here. But okay. Garrison is uh, still at 65%, which is good enough. And we're gonna go salvage. And then we're gonna probably wrap it up for today. Yeah. Next mission or next day, we're gonna see each other. Is gonna be the Will of Kali mission. Alright, let's take a look.
What do we get here? First of all, money. That's very important. We need to really stock up on money so we can afford better mechs later. Um, but I think I'll also pick some mechs just to have them. Maybe we can find some cantinas here and just turn them in. Let's see. 26. Wasn't there something about picking up assassins or cicadas? But I think I just got rid of those missions. Yeah. Ah, uh, whatever. Um... I still do believe that picking both and then finding another Cantina mission later is the way to go about this year. And then we'll pick random stuff. Alrighty. Let's do it. Cool. So, it was one part of that special mission, but again, it was not the one that we are going for. We will repair our mechs in the combat zone. And then we're gonna go all the way down here. Correct? No, no, not all the way down here. This is the... No, wait. Cerberus Hounds. Hazing the weak. Let me quickly check it out. The... The Will of Kali is hazing the weak. Okay, there we go. So, we're gonna go exactly here. And we're gonna play that special mission. But that's a story for another video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel for more MechWarrior 5 Heroes of the Inner Sphere content. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.